Han Dynasty was one of the heydays in ancient China. Han has also gradually evolved from the title of a dynasty towards the name of nationality. Hanfu is the traditional clothing of the Han people. Han has a history which can be traced back for thousands of years, and the charm of Hanfu has also flourished for centuries, leaving the brightest colors in the river of history. The history of clothing is an important part of the development of human civilization. While the ancient Chinese people especially reinvested only cultural meaning into it, the commentary of Zhou mentioned that China attaches great importance to adequate. Therefore, the country is called Xia, and because of its finery, it is called Hua. Hanfu not only embodies Chinese aesthetic taste, but also reflects an accumulation of concepts of adequate religion and culture. The charm of Hanfu embodies the unique spirit of the ancient Chinese people. According to legend, the Chinese clothing is made by the Yellow Emperor. In the Western Zhou Dynasty, the clothing system has gradually been improved and formed the clothing system considering the Emperor's crown and clothing as its core. The clothing system in the Qin and Han Dynasty was based on the adequate system of Xia Shang Zhou Dynasties. Over the next thousands of years, the style of Hanfu changed into different varieties of the costumes in each dynasty. While its basic form didn't change much, Hanfu is composed of yi, chang, headgear, hairstyle, face ornaments, shoes, accessories, and etc. The entire dressing system or dressing style is the combination of all these ornaments, among which the yi and the guan are the core of it. There are two types of yi. One is the kind with the separation of the upper and the lower garments, while the other is the one-piece kind that unites the upper and the lower garments together. The major features of yi are jiao ling you ren, meaning wrapping the right side over before the left, and quan pao da xiu, meaning closed full-body garment with wide and loose sleeves, thus creating a free, flowing, and elegant impression. These characteristics reflect the ancient Chinese pursuit of the natural beauty, which can be showed by the clothing and human activities, and the implicit beauty with harmony and integrity. The plain and easily made Hanfu shows great vitality, along with different gestures of people, and adds unexpectedly natural charm. The flowing and graceful lines lead to tantalizing thoughts and rich imagination. Guan means the crown and its related accessories on head. In ancient China, men and women all had long hair. When it comes to 20 years old for men, they need to participate in a ceremony called Guan Li. In this ceremony, men would put their hair in an abdo and wear adult hats, which can prove their adulthood. This is one of the most important moments in their lives. Correspondingly, women would participate in Ji Li to show there to be adults. Hanfu has extremely rich kinds of armories, and armories of pressures represents the faith and customs in Han culture. The yin yang and eight diagrams, the stars, the sun and the moon, the subjects on earth or in the universe pictured in the armory of Hanfu profoundly reflects the Chinese Asians' understanding of the universe and nature. In addition to yi and guan, there are also the shei, jade pendants, swords, and other accessories in the Hanfu system. Since the ancient time, China has been esteemed as a land of courtesy. In ancient China, the concept of adequate is paramount and enormous all aspects of people's lives. In Hanfu, is an important carrier of Chinese civilization, which takes adequate as its core. The ancient people take good manners as the standards of the adequate system, and Hanfu is just like a set of adequate system people put on all the time. As long as people put on Hanfu, they should behave in accordance with what the adequate system requires. The adequate represents the way people communicate with heaven and the earth. Living in accordance to the adequate is considered as a lifestyle, conforming with the natural way and the laws of the universe. The idea of respecting the heaven and the earth, following the laws of the nature, constitutes the sense of order in the inner world of ancient Chinese people. The ancient Chinese civilization influenced the entire cultural circle of East Asian. 
Nowadays, the traditional clothing in East Asian countries, such as Japanese kimono, Korean hanbok, and so on, has absorbed the features of Chinese clothing to a certain extent. In recent years, along with the continuous affluence of people's material life, people's enthusiasm for a traditional culture has been rising, and the upsurge of the inheritance of Chinese clothing culture has also arisen. Wearing hanfu in a trip or in a party has become a new trend among young people. The revival of hanfu is a new exploration of the beauty of Chinese clothing by contemporary people, and also represents the new recognition of the value of traditional culture by the younger generation. In the long river of history, many glorious ancient civilizations declined and eventually vanished, while Chinese civilization has been inherited till now because of its vigor. Clothing is an important carrier of cultural heritage, and Hanfu fully embodies Chinese characteristics, including gentle, comfortable, elegant, unconventional, and calm personalities. It also represents simple but elegant, natural and fresh aesthetic taste. Centuries' heritage of Hanfu means not only the heritage of unsurpassed beauty, but also the heritage of cultural treasure lasting for centuries.